So I just figured out that Purple Power in the spray bottle actually does a damn good job at cleaning these things up. Now it's not perfect and uh, once these things are left out in the weather for you know months on end there's unless you wax a lawnmower of the deck and really you know put some elbow grease into it you're probably not going to be able to bring that shine back but you'll be able to get most of the crap off with some of this. Now this lawnmower I just fixed this one had a typical carb issue this one I opted to clean out the emulsion tubes in the carburetor. You guys will see that in a separate video probably next weekend. And uh, it seemed to turn out pretty good. This one actually runs a lot better than this one does. Now this is the one that I most recently did a video on. Both of them are Murray. Same, I believe they're the exact same model. But it's kind of funny because this one says it's, the engine's made in the USA of US and global parts. But we'll kind of leave that where it is. I'm really not a big fan of these these engines that uh, Briggs and Stratton is making nowadays. They're just not all that good. But this one seems to run well enough, and hopefully uh, whoever I sell it on to is going to have a nice little lawnmower. So I'm actually going to be cleaning the bottom of the deck off, and normally when I do that, um, sometimes I'll tip the mower over with the, the motor off and clean it off that way, or I'll just put a bunch of water underneath the deck so it kind of sucks the water up and cleans it off that way. It doesn't really matter one way or the other, but you guys will at least hear it run. And uh, other than the carburetor, the air filter was fine. I topped up the oil and the blade's nice and sharp still.